Hey everyone, welcome to the Dungeoning. I am Sir TapTap. You might remember me from this video and more. This is a roguelike platformer sort of deal, or a procedural death dungeon if you so prefer, but uh, I won't pretend to care if you don't. So you're a little dude, excuse me, that hurt. And you get a sword and you've got other weapons. You can switch between your weapons with the shoulder buttons. We're just gonna use the sword for now, because it doesn't have ammo. Be sort of unusual if a sword had ammo. So there are traps in this game! Um, and things hurt a lot! Oop, I didn't see the summary screen. Whatever, I'm sure we'll die again! It's, oh. Roguelike, of course, so, uh, generates different every time. Um, things do a lot of damage relative to, uh, oh, I see the, I see, you can see the traps, that's good. I learned, um, before recording, those barrels hurt a lot. They explode for 50 damage. Do not explode the barrels unless you need to. Do not be near the barrels when they explode. Also, there's wall sliding, kind of, and, uh, wall kicking. Um, ow. I'm poisoned? What? Did that unpoison me? Um, you can press triangle, or you can press, like, the up button. Um, upward face button to, uh, use an item. I'm not sure what item it picks to use. Oh god, these guys are- I don't know if there's, like, a trick to- these jerk holes, but I just try to avoid them. Generally, I want experience, but those guys are really hard, and I have no idea if they're worth killing or not. I haven't killed one of them. We're gonna die really bad. We died. We died on level one! It's really bad. Search chest for exit keys. Using a PlayStation controller, so I'll be referring to those button mappings. It works with 360 pads. Um, Nick D3000, who is the developer, is currently doing controller testing, so I'm sure it'll work on direct input and stuff probably soon. Um, it's currently still on alpha. It's going to be on um, Steam eventually. It got greenlit. Um, there's Windows, which I'm playing, um, Mac and Linux versions coming. Um, not sure what the little... You see up there the stamina bar and stuff? I'm not sure what that breaks out of the interface there. But, to, ow. I always run into these stupid spines. They're like thorns, whatever you want to call them. Spines, thorns. Um, what was I talking about? Um, yeah, gonna be on, on Steam eventually. It's, it got greenlit. It's still in alpha, it seems. I got a... Oh, crap, I forgot to mention. Um, I got a... Um, copy free of charge as a review. What? How did you take so much damage? Oh, he drops lots of stuff. Um, but yeah, I got... Damn it. I got a press copy free of charge from itch.io from their press program. Um, just thought it looked good, so I'd try it. Let me show you how much damage these do. It's a lot. Don't do that. They're chests. I don't know how to open them. Oh. Of course I would hurt myself when there's actual tons of chests right now. I shouldn't have done that. Whatever. It's a roguelike. You make mistakes, and then several hundred hours later, you actually complete a run. That's how you play roguelikes, kids. There is a level up system. I haven't yet actually leveled up, but uh, we'll see that soonish, hopefully. If I don't die again. In fact, you can heal outside of the little thing thinger. Like, it's a bit confusing the way the uh, user interface looks. Because full on, you know, you see, um, full isn't full. It's sort of weird. But whatever. We can get used to it. Oh, I should show the other weapons. Um, I'm not sure how to aim them, though. I'm not sure if I can aim them. Can I aim them? Perhaps I can't. Um, but yeah, these are your projectile weapons. Hmm. Oops. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be any aiming function. Um, one thing I'm not sure I care for, um, I usually prefer my attack to be my square button, you know, the button on the left. Um, and my jump to be X, the button on the bottom. 
but uh, that's not how this game's mapped. This game has square, um, square to block. I don't block very much, so it's, it feels a little weird, but, but it's definitely playable. Though there's no button to, er, there's no uh, remappy controly settings, I don't think. Oh, maybe there, oh! Okay, I'm dumb. I figured it would be on the main menu, but no, you can just do it right here. We're just gonna leave it on defaults, though. I don't want to confuse myself. You can be in full screen, which I'm currently not. Wait, have I leveled up? Oh, no, okay. We've got a bunch of stuff. Oh, you can describe it, excellent. Whatever, I don't really care that- wait, what did these do? Oh, you can just upgrade your stuff just with scrolls? Wait, where did my... I used two scrolls. What did... Oh, whatever. We're just gonna assume I'm better now. Oh, wait, did I use a healing item instead of a... Oh, whatever. We're just gonna leave that rat be, because I don't wanna... Fuck. Excuse me. I hate this guy. I'm gonna kill him. Oh. How dare you poison me with your stupid crap? I don't get how those guys take damage. They randomly just take, like, they take chip damage, basically. And then at some point they just randomly lose half their health. I'm not sure what's going on there. Do we, like, break their shields or hit, like... Why is that bat screaming? It's kind of disconcerting. Excuse me. There we go. Alright. Platforming. We got 10 rocks! Did that... There we go. Not sure what money is for, I'm sure we'll find out. Do not hit the, the thing. That's, that's bad. We already hit that once, so we don't need to do it again. You're not very threatening, Mr. Ghost. We got a ring! Wear rings you find by selecting them in the equipment screen. Okie dokie, then. Let's describe that. This kind of ring was kindly gifted to children. It is imbued with a colorful magic that lights the way in the dark. We've got a glow stick ring! It's possibly the least useful ring in the entire game. Um, not sure about that, just conjecture based on... I don't know why I would use this. If this were Terraria, this would be great. Kind of vaguely looks like Terraria, but no, this is not Terraria at all. Alright, I've learned to destroy the stupid bushes instead of die to them, so that's... We're gonna call that progress. Any secrets? Secrets? I have no idea if they're... What the f... How dare you, sir? How dare you have a secret and put a frickin' barrel? How did I know there was a secret there, and how did there just happen to be a stupid barrel? Whatever. I don't even know what I got. I wasn't paying attention. Whatever. We proceeded to the second level. For the first time, actually. Come here, ghosty. I'm gonna kill you. I assume my score is glowing because this is my highest. Uh, I don't need another green glowing ring. Um, oh, two more commands. Um, if you press down and attack, you do a dash attack. I have no idea why you would want to do this, but you can. Um, down and jump makes you jump backwards like in uh, Symphony of the Night. I also don't know why you'd particularly need to do that, but maybe some bosses or something make it more useful. Now I'm going to be looking for secret areas. I almost wish I hadn't found that other one. I certainly wish I hadn't found it by stabbing my sword into an explosive barrel, but what's done is done. Totally unrelated note, I finished um, Kirby Triple Deluxe recently. Very good game. Strongly recommend it if you have a 3DS. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Um, does this hurt more? Okay, that's better. You better be worth killing. 
Okay, screw it. This 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 thing's not worth killing. All right. And or er, my current bow and arrows are just completely useless. Actually, let's check my equipment here quick. Is this the exact same thing? It's the exact same thing. All right. Universal improvement. Did I universally improve? Holy crap! That is good. <laughs> it actually get, boosts all of your stats. That is very nice. Um, wait, have I leveled up? I... Oh. How do I tell how many points I can spend? Well, I spent them all in strength, so I hope that's good. I kind of like the music. Nice and moody. Okay, I'm gonna kill you, you know what? Oh, you were five hit points away from dying. Oh, that's that's great. Whatever. Actually, do you ever have useful stuff in you? That is... I just used, like, the worst possible item to waste. You have quite the area of effect, you know that? You do have crap in you. Well, I guess I'm gonna hit those from a distance from now on. Ow! I'm good at video games, guys. Alright. Oh, I can see the... Oh! Hmm. I wish... That's kind of hard to see. The, um... You see there? The, um... The grayness is the actual, um, length of my meters. Is that a magic bar? How do I... I don't know how to magic. Like, so let me... Target... L3. Oh! You can target crap! Excuse me! I didn't see you! Please die. No! You die. Screaming bats kind of bothers me. Uh, all right. Oh, you can aim then. Well, that's all of my uh, thingers. All right, I have a shield. I keep forgetting to shield. Let's see if that actually helps in any way. If I just constantly hold it, oh, that slows me down. I get. I didn't even see that rat. I should pay attention, Parker. What are you doing? All the enemies have different little patterns that you can sort of watch. It, excuse me. There we go. Oh, damn it. Why aren't you jumping? Oh. Damn it! I knew that would happen. I freaking knew it. Whatever. No, aim. You can't aim at the bush? You know what? You're not even- you don't deserve to go up there. Little pixel dude. I'm out of potions. Wait, can I use these to heal? What are these? Oh. Oh, that does heal me. Okay. Barely. Well, I guess I'll... Oh. Is that flash like a critical hit? Maybe that's why I was killing those guys, like, at a random speed. Maybe I have criticals. It seemed like a critical. Oh god, not... not hit that. We got a, why is there a soft apple in the remains of an exception? Oh. Explosion. You gotta watch for traps, guys. Don't do what I am doing. Do better than I am doing. Unfortunately, you can't jump up on a wall quite like um, Mega Man X, since you jump far enough away from it. I'd say this is a fair enough run for this is, what, my third go-through? music. Hang on, I think my idiot cat is in the cupboard again. So my cat has learned how to get into cupboards, but not out of them? You would think getting in would be the harder part, right? But apparently not so. Get in me. Alright. Not even gonna bother. Obvious secret. Sure, I'd call that a secret. 
Dorky! Money! Is money for score, or... We can buy stuff at some point. Oh, we have a mini-map! I just noticed that. I'm highly observant. Alright. Physics affect the rocks heavily and arrows a little bit. Yoink. I guess the danger of the ghosts is that they hover around and stuff. Yeah, we do do criticals, because I did two damage. An impressive two damage. Aha! There are damageable walls. I am learning. Yeah, as you can see, sling, very hard to aim. Nice. Oh, damn it. We're just gonna let this guy get over here, because I don't want to fail on spikes again. I kind of wish I could know what I healing item I was about to use up next. I do kind of like I don't have to manually select it. But it feels like I could be wasting an item at any moment. Delicious apples. It's always an apple in those things, too. Alright. Oh, there's a rat, too. I do like the controls. Controls very nicely. Simple controls, but effective. Uh, ow! Aside from the traps, it never feels like BS. And you can recognize the traps, I just don't yet. Like, the rocks, um, we saw it earlier, but the, the rocks that fall on you look a bit different than the normal walls. I'm just not being observant. That's a, I think this is a very important tenet to, to get right in roguelikes. Um, the thing about a proper roguelike is that it's procedural, not random. Um, random generation can be really screwed up and um, not fair. But procedural lets you, you know, control the... Uh... Can I drop that? Hmm. I don't want the peasant's bow since I have the better one. Oh, whatever. Um, but randomness can be unfair or even impossible, but with procedural generation what you're doing is, you know, having some fair baseline, hopefully, of, uh, like, in Binding of Isaac there are specific rooms that you can get, there's no, like, it's not completely random. Um, so what a procedural game should do is you know, ramp up difficulty somewhat naturally and keep things reasonably fair so it's not like completely fighting a random number generator. You're fighting... it's different every time but it should still be fair. Um, and that's something you get a feel of with better and more balanced procedural games. Um, what is this? Come on, use works with metal... Ah! Protects you from high temperatures. Uh, I can equip two rings anyway. Equip four, three? No, of course not. I'm not sure why you only have two fingers to wear rings on in games like this. Um. Oh, I don't even have enough gold for that. The scroll of the Wa! Uh, trying to press L3 to describe items, but it doesn't let you describe items here. Oh, I want some of these swords, but I can't get them. Nothing for me, thanks. I still have not intentionally used my shield at all in this run. Die. Come here. Um, that looks unpleasant. That looks highly unpleasant! Excuse me, sir! Stop that! Stop with the eyes! I don't care for the eyes! Oh god, okay, okay. Ugh. Target it. Okay. Okay, this is what the bow is for. Alright. That wasn't too bad. I should heal though. Alright, better. I do wish I could sell items. Can I... Is there any... Not really. 
there's some... I don't see any way to drop. Nah. Oh well. I would like to get rid of my peasant's bow since I have a hunter's bow now, but whatever. Chair. It'll just be a reminder of how far I've come. Sweet mushrooms. Stupid thorny plants think they can get in my way. Nuh-uh. No way. I saw that! Yep, I almost hit that with my thing. That would not have been pleasant. Got lots of rocks. Guess that makes sense we blew up a wall, didn't we? That's where we're getting rocks from. Um, this wall looks incredibly suspicious. Oh, damn it! Yep, knew it. I see you, punk. I see you too. Don't think I don't see you. you can't hide from me with your wally ways. No, it's just actually a wall. How oh, boring! Huh. Oh well. Just don't really seem worth killing. Whoop. That was very close. Controls are very tight, I like... God damn it. I was doing so well on not hitting those. I wish you could somehow set my order of, like, things, or throw them away, or whatever. Because I wanted to be able to just, like, instant switch to the hunter bow, but I really can't. Oh, forget if I mentioned this, but the... Ow! Falling damage is a thing. That's good to know. Um... The game is apparently an alpha, it's currently like listed as version 6.8, um, coming to Steam soonish. Uh, I'm not sure where the development currently is, like, uh, there weren't too many updates on the uh, website, there's a website, it'll, it'll be in the description. Link to where you can get the game and any relevant websites will always be in the uh, description. If they're not, yell at me, because that means I've forgotten and I'm a very bad person. Chest key. Got a chest key in a chest. Alright. This is stupid. Stupid like a fox. How much money do we have? Oh, do I... Do I need to level up? What? What do stats do? Well, crap. Um, more vitality. Wait, that gave me... I was hoping vitality was health, not stamina. Wait, how much? No, how much gold? 83. I don't think that's enough to get anything relevant. Oh, I have lots of useful little items. What is this? One, one. I didn't mean to eat that. All right. Still don't know what my- oh! Different background time! Gunshots? Ugh. Oh, it's that, I think. Yeah, it's that. Why did I switch to that? Yep, you can't damage that. Whatever. It's not getting impaled. Priority one, do not get impaled. Priority two, kill the hell out of that. I always want to use the, um, right stick, not the left stick, because I don't want to move my hand off the d-pad. It's easy to move my hand, like, it doesn't feel like a big deal to move off of the, uh, face buttons. But it, like, I don't want to move off the deep. excuse me, what are you? I don't know what you are, I want to kill you. Uh, I don't like this guy! I don't know why he's giving me so much trouble. He's just a normal slime, he just does a bit more damage. Kill him. Okay. We survived! Uh, that looks unpleasant. Excuse me, sir! Would you like to die? Oh. He, he would not like to die. Hmm. You're a stubborn bugger, aren't you? 
We're, you know what? Screw that. And jump into the spikes. That's good. That's that's excellent. Um, I could use a better indication of when I've leveled up. Honestly, I I'm never sure when that has happened. No oh, items. I out of healing items. Hmm, that's unfortunate. Not sure, why I didn't jump there. All right. Things are turning bad quickly. But we found a new area, so that's an okay time to die, right? Eh, let's pretend it is. Tell me your secrets, Wall. I see you. Not sure the point of all of these breakable walls that don't appear to actually be hiding anything. Zip! I thought that was a thing you can stand on. It wasn't! Good to know. Okay. Oh. Ow. That, that's the thing I don't wanna... Yeah. That's better. Is that a... Huh. It's a classical bomb. Oh. oh. I didn't see you! Excuse me, sir. Sir. Please die. Thank you. I lost my train of thought, but yeah, uh, hitting a thorn bush with arrows, that's, that's the kind of guy I am. It's just, it's just me. Just me, baby. Uh, anything behind this wall? No? Not worth trying to break that then. Excuse me? Oh, exit. generally a poor idea to go deeper down into a roguelike um, until you have like cleared the floor basically because you want to get all the uh, items and such you can no secret before you go to the next level which is invariably harder but damn it since this is a let's play slash first impression sort of deal we are just gonna go ahead and do it that's not gonna god damn it I hate when I forget there's fallen damage. It's fairly rare in platformers. Then again, roguelike, so dying is part of the... Oh god. Yeah, when these guys come out, I don't like that, you know, it takes me a minute to go, okay, what do I... Oh, right, I need to switch to my thing, my bow, then I got a target. In fact... Actually, no, I'm not gonna... You can change the controls, like, I wanna... Personally, I would change attack to square, block to circle, um... And describe, slash other crap, to R3. But uh, I'm not gonna do that, because I'm already getting used to these controls, and I don't want to start screwing up in the middle of a video. But, remember that you can customize controls, and should do so. As early as possible, so you don't have muscle memory of the different controls. What is that? I saw like a floating exclamation point. Oh, what the hell? What are you? Uh, excuse me! Ow! Well, he's dead now, but he was a jerk. It's a good eulogy or not eulogy. Epitaph. That's what I was trying to go for. That's just that's just mean. Trying to put one of those fake walls and there's not actually anything behind it. Okay. Let's not panic this time. Shoot your thing. Alright. And you're dead. Did, did that sound mean I leveled up? I don't... Sure did. I don't know when I've leveled up. That seems... Bad. Oh god! No! No! Nope! Nope! That's not happening. Is not happening today. Ugh. I... Hmm, no, it's not worth getting what's in that. I do want whatever's in that bush. But if I do that, I'll probably take damage. Ah! Uh. Uh. God damn it. 
Oh, Healy items. Hmm. Alright. Trying to avoid that. Alright, what? Hmm. I want that chest. That chest is currently my life goal. Oh. <laughs> That's- <laughs> What?! Aw, oh, son of a- Frickin' Mimic. The confident rogue will push down when attacking. Oh, maybe that does more damage. Well, that was the dungeoning! Pretty cool. Ah, oh, we almost got 10,000. At least we got over 9,000. That's that's good. Well, that was the dungeoning. Pretty cool. Um, there'll be a link to where you can buy it and all of that good stuff. Uh, not sure what all's you know going to be added in the newer versions, but uh, pretty cool if you're interested in roguelike platformy dealies. <laughs>